Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today let's practice Lego 240 Search a 2D Matrix 2. Okay, it says uh, write an efficient algorithm that searches for a value target in a matrix. And the matrix has the following properties. The first is that for in the one row, it is search sorted from left to right. And in, in a column, in the same column, it is also sorted from top to down. Okay, so now uh, for the example one, the target number is five. So like, um, we can start from the easiest way. So and let's start from the one. The smallest number in the matrix one. So we know that five is bigger than one. So it will go either right or either left, either right or either down. But it is so difficult to choose whether you should go right or you should go down, right? So if you choose a number or you, you start to search for the matrix in the top left corner, then you have two directions to go to search for the target number. However, now if you can start to search for the number from a different position, this position, then you will only have one direction to go. Let's say you want to find a five here. So you know like for five, five is is smaller than fifteen. So it cannot go down. It can only go left. So go search for this number and then 5 is still smaller than 11 so it will go to search for 7 and also 5 is still smaller than 7 so it will search so it will um let's go find go to this position is 4 and 5 is bigger than 4 so it goes down to 5 and then yeah we reach the target and we know that five is indeed in the matrix so if we start from the right up corner of the matrix we can either if the number is bigger than 15 then we go down if the number is smaller than the current number then we go left okay Maybe like you have like um, some questions. For example, um, let's say we want to find the number fourteen, and we still start from this position fifteen. So we know that fifteen, fourteen is smaller than fifteen. So we search, we goes to this position and then get the number eleven. And then we know um, 14 is bigger than 11. And then we search for the following number 12. And 14 is bigger than 12. So we go to search for 16. I have a question like here. Since we go from 15 to 11 and then 11 to 12 and then there is a number 14. 14 is bigger than 12. Why now we why don't we go right again to 19? Okay, and that is because we already know that the number 19 is bigger than the number 
19 is bigger than the number 15, right? Because the array is sorted. The column here is sorted. And we already know that the 14, the talking number we want to find, is actually smaller than the 15. So it's gender 15. So in this num in this position two, we will never go right because we know this number here will be bigger than this number here. So that is why we will only go one direction. That is why um in twelve we'll never go right. And or we can only choose to go down. Okay. Then the time complexity is um is m plus n, right? Because you only like to go down, up, down, and go to the left. And the space complexity, let's think about it. Okay, it is a constant. Because we don't have to like to keep other structures to memorize the numbers here. Okay, now let's move to coding part. Okay. So we would like to have two pointers, R and C, there um, points to the row and the column of the current cell we are visiting. So we have R and C. And since we want to start from the, uh, the top right corner, then the R is 0 and the C is the um, length of matrix 0 minus 1. Okay, so mm, while so um, R is smaller than length of matrix N C is bigger than minus one. It means that um, while we are still still searching the matrix, while the R and C are still in the bound of the matrix. And so if the matrix R and C is equal to the target number, then we'll return true. If matrix we want to search, let's see, now it's um, bigger than our target number. Okay, let's see, yeah. change the position. The target number is bigger than Our current number, we know that um, it wants to go to the next row. So we uh, increase the R by 1, else it means if the target number we want to search is smaller than the current visited number, and then we want to search for a number that is left. So we want to uh, minus the C by one. And if we jump out of the while loop and still cannot find out the target number, it means the number doesn't exist in the matrix. So we'll return false. Okay, let's try. Oh, let's see. Tar oh, here is a typo. Target. Okay. Okay. I 
echo. So this solution works. Thank you for your watching.